What's up, guys? This is Rob. Thank you for tuning in. If you have never been here before, the purpose of this show is to encourage, inspire, and I hope give insight into what can be sort of a strange industry. As always, I'm talking about comics. So uh, I've had a pretty wild week after the last episode. And just just right up front, if you have not seen my last episode, episode, I, be I believe it's 15. Um, you need to go back and check that out because nothing is going to make sense about this episode if you haven't seen the other one. Uh, so right off the top, as I said in the last episode, um, you know, last episode came because it came from something that had been on my chest for quite some time, a long time brewing, literally years of brewing. And I just shared something that had, had been hanging out with me for a while and I wanted to get it out there. And I knew just based off the internet and how comics Twitter can be, I knew that it would, uh, potentially start some arguments, uh, and I was I was fine with that. I believed in what I said. I have no regrets. Um, and it ended up being surprisingly far more positive than I could have ima um, imagined. I got tons of emails, DMs, comments, text messages from people just saying thank you for having a civil conversation and just speaking out about this because it doesn't seem like a lot of people are doing it, at least not in a, in a civil fashion. So that was great. Uh, if you tuned into that, if you commented, and you, if we interacted in any way, I appreciate you, whether or not you, whether or not we agreed or not, I appreciate you at least being civil about it. And even some of the folks who were not civil about it, I appreciate you tuning into it. Uh, you know, my goal for this channel, uh, as I said, is uh, to be sort of a sensible alternative and a sane alternative to a lot of the hyperbole that tends to be on the internet, especially in the comic book space. I just want to have some, some genuine, thoughtful conversation float some new ideas out there because I like ideas. Uh, I like just kind of, you know, <laughs> experimenting and seeing what happens. So last week was, was, was sort of that. So thank you again. If you, if you're in it, I'm all about furthering the discourse and, uh, keeping things going. So, uh, something that, um, something that really I took away from last week, I think last week really affirmed to me what I want this show to become. And part of the show today is going to be not just acknowledging last week, but talking about where we're going. And last week really affirmed to me that uh, what I want the show to become and it clarified for me who I want this show to be for. You know, when you are anytime you're making something, you, you usually need to think about who you're making it for. And for a long time, I've struggled with what I want this to be and who this is for. And the obvious answer is, oh, this is for people who like comics. But I don't think that's completely true. I think that's part of it. But the more I've gotten into this, I'm 16 or 17 episodes in now, the more I've gone into this, the more I've seen, I don't think I just want it to be for people who like comics, though that is part of it. I, I've been seeking to make something sort of universal for people even outside of the, the industry, even people who are not creative. Uh, and I want to offer something for, for, for you guys as well. So last week really clarify some things for me. So now I think, I think the person, well, let's first, let's talk about who I am as a, as a person. I'm a, I'm a person who's made lots of mistakes in my life. I've made some huge mistakes, uh, but thank God I've, I've actually been given a lot of grace in my life to where I don't have to live under the cloud of the things I've done in the past. I've been forgiven for them. And it's, that's been incredibly liberating. And because of that, I'm not haunted by my, my, my mistakes. I actually learned from them. So I make mistakes. I still struggle. A lot of what I talk about on this channel has been a theme of trying to make improvements, not being perfect at all, but also struggling through it and seeking to make today better than better than yesterday was learning from what I the dumb things I did yesterday and doing better today. And I think that may be part of who this is for. I, that, that, may, that might be my core audience, honestly, is people that People who are a little jacked up, who, who are just trying to do a little better today, learn some new things uh, and improve, whether that's in your art, in your craft, whatever that craft may be, in your career, in your family, whatever. Uh, I think, I mean, for me, as I said, I aspire to learn from my mistakes. And a lot of everything I've been doing in this show thus far, even all the process stuff, has always been about that. It's about improvement, taking a mess and bringing order to it, taking chaos and bringing order to it. 
And that goes for my art, my writing, how I raise my kids, everything. I'm trying to do better. I'm trying to learn and improve. So that's really what this is about. So uh, if that's you, if you're in the same boat, if you're trying to learn and improve and do better, and uh, that's, that's one of your core things, and this is probably going to be your channel. So that's, I'm still filling out what it's going to be. We're going to experiment and try some new things, but I think that's the core, the core thing. Because uh, at the end of the day, I think focusing just on comics is too narrow. It's too narrow of a, of a, of a little niche. Uh, I'm, and besides that, I'm not just a comic artist. So I want to broaden the scope of what I'm doing here. Because last week, if it showed me anything, I think it's that a lot of people are hungry. They're really hungry for a better online conversation. So that's what I'm aiming for. Uh, and so if you're watching my videos, I do want you to leave inspired, encouraged, and a little bit better than you were before you watched this show. Um, so the, those are the values that I'm basically working from on this show. I'm working from excellence. I want to be excellent in everything that I do. I want to work hard. I'm very di diligent in my, in my craft. Um, I try to be integrous as best as I can and be as much of a straight shooter as I possibly can. Not, not at all perfect, but I'm trying. Uh, honor. I, I, try, I strive to be an honorable person. And, uh, and grace as well for myself and for other people, uh, which is sorely lacking, especially in today's online space and in the world at large. So if, if those values ring true with you, I think you're going to get something here. And I hope, <laughs> I hope that could be something that can be a blessing to you, especially in, in this crazy, uh, sometimes very dark world. So talk to me. I mean, that's, um, that's pretty much it for this show. I wanted to, again, address last week's show and uh, kind of tie things up, but also point toward the future of where we're going. And uh, so, but I want to hear from you. I don't want this to be just me talking. I don't want this to, to just be my thing. I want this to be something that you think is valuable to you wherever you are. So talk to me. Hit me in the comment section. Let me know what are you, what, what questions do you have? What are some interesting ideas for shows that you, you want to see? Uh, just, just let me hear from you. Uh, and besides that, if, as always, if you think this is helpful, if any of the past episodes I've done, if you can think of someone they'd be helpful to, by all means, please share it. It is there as a tool free of charge, uh, an asset that you can share with other people. Uh, so yeah, let me know. Let me hear from you. I want to hear from you. So that's about it for this week, guys. Next week, I'll be back with more normal programming <laughs> again, still experimenting with the process stuff. And, uh, I think I may do more of these kind of face-to-face -face conversations. Also, if you have not tried them yet, try out the uh, my other episodes, the uh, sketchbook sessions. They're just some really nice and tight, usually around 10 to 12 minute videos, just process stuff, really calming. I'm trying to create an environment here that is sort of an oasis from the normal online discourse. Like a lot of the internet is just yelling at you and trying to sell you things. I would love to create a space that you could just come and uh, be inspired that's kind of calm, that's kind of sane, that you walk away from feeling sort of refreshed. So at least that's, that's my hope. So we'll see if we get there. But thank you again for tuning in. Uh, I'll see you next week. I hope your week is excellent. I hope it's productive and very peaceful. I'll see you guys then. Bye.